guys and welcome back to another video today I'm going to entitle my video the real me see a few days ago I got rather rude comments on a video I did reacting to Mitchell Halajic because I called him sexy in my video this girl called me a creep and a pervert told me that I shouldn't be calling little boys sexy and she went on to say I live in a dirty apartment, which I do not. That I am fat and I eat too much. And it really hurt my feelings. But I'm here to tell you guys that I'm no longer going to let stuff like that get to me. Because this is me. I'm going to be 100% real with you guys. I mean, I've already told you some things about me. I am weird, yes. Sometimes I could be a walking disaster. Um, my birthday is May 30th. I was born in 1978. Um, I don't eat fruits and veggies, which is really weird, but I don't. I'm a Gemini. Um... I don't have any friends, so to speak. I don't, I've never had a boyfriend, never. Not even in high school, I never had a boyfriend. Any guy that ever found out I liked him either made fun of me for it or was just completely disgusted by the idea. Never had my first kiss. Um, I'm still, still pure. I'm going to put it that way. Um, and up until I met someone special, well not really met, but found someone special, no one's ever called me beautiful. So I felt really down on myself. I always felt like I was standing on the outside looking in. Like I was a loner. I never went to my prom because I never had anyone to go with. No friends, no boyfriend. It was really sad for me. I hated being on the outside. I hated not having friends. But for some reason, nobody liked me, and I never understood why. Then in October, September, October, I stumbled across Mitchell Halachuk. He's a wonderful YouTuber, and he has changed my life. He was the first guy, the first person outside of my family to call me beautiful. To tell me that, you know, I am beautiful and I am special. And he said that we could be besties, which I hope you still are. Mitchell has made me feel so special. Mitchell has made helped me look into a mirror and accept me for who I am. Look, guys, I know I'm not a beauty queen. And I never wanted to pretend to be like one. But when he called me beautiful, it changed my whole per perspective. For the first time, I started to accept myself for who I was. I could look in a mirror and not be ashamed of what I saw. What I saw was someone beautiful and special. He helped me by helping me do YouTube. Started doing YouTube channel because of him. I'm not afraid to show people the real me. Mitchell is so sweet and so kind and so generous and so giving and loving and funny. He's got a great sense of humor. And he's 100% real. And he's the first person that's ever been so nice and so kind to me. He's shown me so much love and so much caring. He invited me into his family, his son of a Mitch family. And it's just been an amazing journey with him. And I love him dearly from the bottom of my heart. I do consider him a, my friend. <clears throat> When someone has done for me what he has done for me, it's amazing. I can finally be proud of who I see when I look into a mirror because of Mitchell. 
I could be, I'm happy with who I am. I'm happy with my body. I'm not ashamed of my body anymore because of him. I just wish that other people could see what he sees. I wish that I could have more friends. I hate being alone all the time. And yes, I I live with my mom, but that is because I'm helping her raise my seven-year-old niece. My mom has custody of her because, unfortunately, <clears throat> her, both of her parents are heroin users. One of them being my sister. Her father, she doesn't even know who he is. The last time he saw her, she was baby. She hasn't seen her mother since she was three years old. My mom had to take custody of her because of my sister's drug use. And when, when my niece was still a baby, I am the one that got up with her during the night and fed her and changed her. Well, my sister laid in the same room with her while she cried and didn't even hear her. I basically honestly love that little girl like she were my own daughter. She's probably the only thing I'm going to get closest to having a kid with. Because at the rate, I mean, I'm almost 40 years old. And at the rate I'm going, I'm never going to have a child of my own. And she's the closest thing I've got to it. And I love her with all my heart. And I love with my mom. And it was tough for a while to figure out why I was existing. But Mitchell helped me realize that everybody's life has a purpose, has meaning. And given everything that he's been through in his life, from the time that he was a child growing up without a father, you know, he said his mother was never really there for him like he needed to be. When he was about 11 or 12, he went to live with his grandma, who raised him from that time on. And yes, his grandma was poor, but she still somehow made sure that Mitchell got what he really needed. And unfortunately, in January, his grandma passed away. She was an amazing lady. She raised an amazing kid. And she'd be very proud of Mitchell today. I know she would. She has given him a lot. She took him in and raised him. He may have been a difficult teenager, but she never gave up on him. She believed in him. I believe in him. I believe he's going to achieve great things in his life. And for him to come from where he, what he's been through, with depression and seeing a lot of drug use, and seeing depression and suicide. Because he knew, he knew of two people that he was acquaintances with that had killed themselves. So he, I mean, he doesn't even admit it that he was been neglected as a child. And he grew up with a really bad childhood, but somehow, I don't know how, this, this man came out on the other side being the sweetest, kindest, gentlest, loving, caring, charismatic, fun, happy, go lucky kid. And I would love the opportunity to meet him someday. I want to meet the person who's my inspiration. The one that inspires me to be the best me I can be. You know, I always try to figure out What's the best about me? But now I know I am the best. I am the best, Shannon Ray Kensley. And that's pretty big. Because it's really hard sometimes just to be yourself. But I've learned along the way to be myself. And if people can accept to be for who I am, then that's their problem. They're getting out on, they're missing out on getting to know a really great person. Because I do care deeply. I am a good listener, and I will always be there when I am needed. 
and Mitchell, that goes for you too if you watch this video, which I hope you do. Always know that I'm there for you if you ever need anyone to talk to. If you're ever feeling down and out, and you're sad and lonely, you need someone to talk to, know I'm always there. You can Snapchat me, you have my phone number, you can call me. I'm always going to be there for you, night or day. Because I'm a true best friend. I know so much about you. I know you don't like tomatoes and carrot. Tomato and cucumber, sorry. You're a Gemini. Your birthday is June 12th. And you were born in 1997. You have beautiful brown eyes. An amazing smile. You're six foot one. You hate roller coasters. You hate any kind of fair rides. You love to go clubbing. You love your amazing girlfriend, Mara, who is absolutely beautiful. And <clears throat> I wish you guys all the happiness in the world. Your grandma's name was Karen Halachuk. You have a wonderful, beautiful mother. You have a sister named Miranda Halachuk. You're from Prince George, British Columbia. Canada, you now live in Calgary, Alberta, Canada. You're almost 21 years old. Fed the childhood from hell. Used to work at McDonald's, Red Robin. You love Starbucks and Tim Hortons. You love McDonald's. You work out every day. You like rock and rap music? You have the dopest merch in the world. Teespring.com slash store slash Mitchell Reacts. Go get yours. Make sure you subscribe to Mitchell's channel, Mitchell Reacts. And turn on the notification bell. Make sure you subscribe to me and turn on the notification bell. You can also subscribe to a second channel, which he hasn't posted on quite some time, but it's Mitchell Haladchuk. You can follow him on all his social medias. Link in his description to this video, so if you go watch, you can follow me on all my social medias. And show me all the love in the world, show him all the love in the world. You could really use it. <clears throat> he puts out amazing videos every day. He's just, uh, he's just, uh, he's an amazing guy. He's such an inspiration to me. He really is. And he is to so many people. Because he's the only YouTuber I know that'll be 100% real with you. And he'll tell you like it is. He gives good advice. He might not think he makes a difference, but he really does. He's changed my life. And I consider him a good friend and part of the family. And for now, I'm going to call mine the SK family, which is my initials, Shannon Kinsley. So if you guys want to be part of the SK family, make sure you join. And I do love all my subscribers. You guys mean the world to me. And I love that you watch my videos. And I hope to only keep growing. It's really hard to say all those. To, to, to keep coming up with wonderful things to say about Mitchell because I've said them all. He's my guardian angel. He really is. He's a blessing in my life. I am so blessed to have him as part of my life. And he can... You know, down the road he stops liking my tweets. He stops responding to my comments on his videos. I'm not going to hold it against him. I'm going to keep following him and I'm going to be a true son of a Mitch to the end. He could turn out to hate my guts, and I'm not going to stop loving him because of what he's done for me. 
You hear me, Mitchell? I'm never going to stop loving you. And I promise you, if there's anything I could do for you, just let me know and I will do it. Because as far as I'm concerned, you deserve the world. You deserve all your wishes to come true. Because you're amazing, you're special, you're sweet. And everything you've been through in your life, and you come out on the other side as sweet as you are, it's amazing. And your grandma did an amazing job raising you, and I'm so sorry that you lost her. Because I know how super duper close you were to her. And I know how heartbreaking it was when she passed away. You know, that's, that's why they say that life is so precious. And so sweet and so short. That we shouldn't spend it hating on each other. We should spend it loving one another. Because before you know it, it's gone. And you never know what you really have till you don't have it anymore. And if Mitchell stopped being in my life, it would break my heart. Because he, I consider him one of my best friends. And I just hope he feels the same way too, because I do love him. I love him with all my heart. And I always will. Thank you so much, Mitchell, for all you've done. Thank you so much for making it so easy to open up to people. And I hope you keep being the sweet, kind, gentle, caring, loving fun, just all around amazing, wonderful person that you are. Don't ever change, Mitchell. You're perfect the way you are. And stop putting yourself down. You're not ugly. You're a very good looking person inside and out. And you have the most beautiful soul I've ever seen. You have a beautiful smile and you have beautiful eyes. Some of us could only be so lucky. Because sometimes I don't always see a beautiful person when I look at myself. I know I have a beautiful soul. But I don't know. Am I worthy enough to have friends? What is it about me that people don't like? What is it about me that makes them not want to be my friend? Does anybody really know? <coughs> Let me know down in the comments what you think. Would you guys ever want to be my friend? And Mitchell, I hope you do watch this video. Well, I'm going to end the video. Thank you guys for listening to my goofy ramblings as usual. But I want to be 100% real with you guys and let you know how I was feeling. I love you guys. Make sure you smash that like button. Make sure you subscribe and turn on that notification bell. Make sure you subscribe to Mitchell Reacts and turn on his notification bell. Go cop his merch at teesprings.com slash store slash Mitchell Reacts. Show him all the love in the world because God knows he deserves it. Because he's a very amazing person. And I hope he keeps doing good in the world. I love you guys. I love you, Mitchell. I always will. And, um, yeah, I hope you guys have a blessed day, night, weekend, whenever you're watching this video. And stay kind. Stay happy. I know that I hope you always stay blessed. God bless and peace.